Hello everyone, today I have a quick unboxing and demo of this mini hair straightener by Melencia. It's called mini because it is travel size so you can take it with you on the go. Opening up the packaging is as simple as sliding it out and you see you're first greeted with the straightening iron which is also purple. It's also nice to see that the power plug is protected with plastic. Next we have a cloth carrying bag so you can use this to store your straightener when you're not using it. And then we have a power adapter from the US um, plug to a European one if you are using 240 volts instead of 120 here in the US. Last thing in the box is of course the instruction guide. It's a really quick pamphlet. It also tells you some warnings, the warranty that's offered with this product. And there's also a very big warning sticker on the iron itself. Of course this can get really hot and can cause burns so definitely be careful around children. And of course be careful in general. So now taking a quick overview of the actual iron itself, you can see it's very short in length, definitely less than a foot, including the cable if you wrap it up nicely, it even comes with some nice cable management too. The shell of the straightener is plastic so it's insulated from the heat of the ironing plate and there's a very simple one button switch to turn it on and off and you can easily tell when the iron is on with this red LED light that turns on when the straightener is switched on. So operation is very simple, just need to plug it in to power it up and then you're good to go. So now I'm just going to go ahead and move on to the demo portion of this video. Um, as you can see here, I have naturally straight hair, so I don't really use a straightening iron that much. What I might do if I want to keep my hair straight is to kind of just clean up the loose ends at the bottom where it might flare out a little bit so it just keeps it nice and straight. Of course, if you have naturally curly or wavy hair, this will also help straighten your hair. But even with those of us who have naturally straight hair, we can use the straightening iron to actually make waves or curls. If you haven't really worked with the straightening iron before, you may want to practice the motion in the air with the iron turned off. So all you have to do is hold it as you normally would, clamp down, and then do kind of like a, as if you were revving up a motorcycle. So you want to turn the iron 180 degrees outward so your thumb is now facing away from you. Of course, if you want curls in the other direction, you just have to turn your wrist the other way, but I generally recommend to do it outward first just to make sure that the iron is kind of away from your face. So you can practice this motion in the air and of course with a strand of hair without the heat on just so you get used to it. So when you put it on your strand of hair, you want to have your other hand holding down the hair so that you make sure that the hair is kind of really pressing against the plate so that it will get that nice curve. Once you think you got the motion down, you can go ahead and turn on the straightening iron. And you can also, while it heats up, which only takes about a minute, you can go ahead and brush your hair to make sure there are no tangles. So once the iron is adequately hot, you can go ahead and select a clump of hair. Not too thick that it wouldn't really straighten very effectively, but not too thin that you might burn it. You also might want to consider isolating that particular clump of hair by um, pushing the rest of your hair to the back if your hair is long enough to do so. Um, once you have that ready, you want to go ahead and put in that twist motion like I showed you before. And then go ahead and support the strand with your other hand and then slowly move the iron down. Of course, how fast you move your iron down is going to vary per person depending on how much hair you clump together and how thick your hair is in general. But if you're still kind of new to this, you might want to just experiment with start off a little bit faster. And if you see that you're not really getting the curly results or wavy results that you're looking for, go ahead and try again and do it a little bit longer. And as you can see, I have managed to kind of volumize my otherwise thin straight hair. So doing that to the other side as well. You can see the results after doing this for about 5 minutes. Of course, there are multiple ways to use a straightening iron to style your hair. Of course, you can obviously research on YouTube for other tutorials. But since I am a product reviewer here, I have to say that this particular mini straightener is very easy to use. It heats up quickly and it also cools down quickly. It's very simple to operate and it gets pretty great results for what it is. So if you are interested in this mini lavender straightener, you can go ahead and check out the description for the product link.